signed up for Dan Foss's Refrigerant Week September 16 through 20. If not, head over to their Refrigerant Transition Center and check out some of the free tools they've made available. You can download a Refrigerant Retrofit Guide, the Refrigerant Slider app, their low global warming potential tool, and a lot more. Should help you get ready to work with new refrigerants. Link in description below. Dan Foss has scheduled 11, you read that right, 11 webinars as part of their upcoming Refrigerant Week, September 16 through 20. If you've wondered about new refrigerants and how to work with them, there's going to be at least one that you'll want to sign up for. See the whole list in the link below in the description. Hashtag Refrigerant Week. Got a walk-in box not cooling. I gotta put my ladder up here and get on the roof. And I'll bring you guys along. This is our unit. Turn the breaker off. I can smell like electrical smell, so I wanna take this cover off and see if that contactor's burned up. I can totally, see. it smells like burned up contactor. That's what I'm smelling. I picked up the new uh, Harry Dickerson fig figured it out. I picked up the new Milwaukee uh, short space fuel impact. It's a lot smaller than the other ones. It's working out pretty good. I didn't get the hydraulic one. I think the hydraulic's the newest. But I got that one. Yeah, look what we're looking at here. Probably burned up contactor. take the cover off the contactor and see what the contacts are like. The run cap went too. Look, it's all puffed up. I bet all these star components fried. Let's check it out. Yeah, look at that. That wire is burned up right there. Coming off the bottom of the contactor is all burned up right in there. Look at that. Torchomatic 1000. Probably, uh, that's what took out the star component. Definitely that run cap shot. I think, I will see if the star cap lives. Trying to find some star components. The star cap's blown up too. Awesome. Video. You can see she's up and running. My little mess down there. I had a little bit of shade. So I was able to take my hat off. That was nice. Um, I ended up, what they had at the little parts place in town was a an 80, uh, 80 microfarad run capacitor, so they had an 80 by 5. So I just used the 80 part. You can see she's all blown out. Here's the contactor. I had a contactor on my truck. Look at this. So you guys, this. Don't even know what to make of that there it's wasted um i did actually i'm not using the correct start capacitor right now so what i did was i just called rsd and i ordered up the correct start components for this compressor they're going to be coming it's friday afternoon like six at night um, you got to do what you got to do to get them running that'll get them by till i get the right start components i did have a contactor on the truck i'm reusing the same potential relay um, and I did get a, I got a start cap that was close and a run cap that's the correct run cap. So I could actually leave that run capacitor in there. But I did, uh, I do have the uh, potential relay and the correct start capacitor coming. And sometimes that's what you got to do to get them by. I got to tidy, I got to tidy this up here. <laughs> 